Okay, so welcome to another exhilarating, orgasm-prone episode of Crown Trigger. Let's play Crown Trigger, that is. It's your boy, Mr. Rock7. I'm lost as fuck right now, and I'm trying to find the, my way back into the main quest. So there's a crystal we're supposed to examine. I see no crystal around here. It's that one broken chain there for it. Okay. Well, there's an encounter for the first time in like five million years, so that probably means we're going the right direction. Total destruction. I love that. Let me see if there's anything down there. No. Another law piece. Oh, come on. Okay, they're giving us an option to avoid them. That's great. Come on, Robo. Let's go. Oh no. They seem to be ice based, so Oh, we can only attack them individually. Oh, 
Okay, not in the fourth digit when it comes to health, so that's good. And Rob needs Robo needs to fucking speed up because he is too fucking slow right now. I want to diversify so I can find out the nature of their health. Okay, so it's not a lot. That's good. Although they do self-regenerate. for right now. Uh, that rock over there. Rocks with eyes. They don't hit hard at all, that's good. Even these early moves provide some modicum of use. Turn around, Luca. Yeah, Chrono's at at the moment. He's riding the short bus. We got a lot of eaters though, so since I do want to heal up at the moment, I'm gonna have him cure everybody, and then we'll compensate him with a couple of eaters. But let's give everyone an eater right now. Come on, Rubble, hurry the fuck up, nigga. Okay, rocket roll. Can we equip that on somebody? Oh, that load helm actually was a good stat boost for her. But this gives her the benefit of having two status ailments blocked. Stop and slow. And that may be a hint.
He hasn't had a new weapon in a while. Why is that? Yeah, this is exactly where we're supposed to go. This is what the guide said. So we interact with this, and then the boss comes out. I can't wait, I'm excited. <clears throat> For now, that is the coolest boss we've ever seen. Okay, so if I'm around 15 or below, odds are I will get clapped. I don't know how I could be in that low level if all these fixed fights in the game. Mm. Okay, let's see. Okay. We need a heal all kind of move right now. Yeah, the hands have OD health. Like 2000 and they regenerate. Yeah, this thing is going to get me clapped quickly. We got a heal beam in the cut. Let's try a fire sword on the left hand. Okay, it's effective. Yeah, this guy needs to stop overdoing it. Okay, we need a revive for Chrono.
have him cast life. We use fire sword on this. Without that right arm, he is a lot easier to deal with. That goes without saying. Damn. I didn't even get a hit on him yet. Let me finish the rest of this. Okay, that's a good point. I probably shouldn't worry about the left arm. He recovers his arms too fast. He doesn't even give us the normal counting procedure. And everyone here is too fucking slow. Come on, guys. Time is of the essence. Okay, he attacks too? Yeah, well, it's not that much, so... I want to attack his fucking arm. Oh well.
can now use heal beam. So he has two consecutive field attacks. Okay, Robo Tackle. Good thing that thing is a terrible healer. When I say terrible healer, I mean like the shittiest healer ever. I'm doing a lot better than I initially thought I would, considering how unfair this boss is on paper. Although I do gotta keep my cool when I'm facing off with this guy. Like, Robo is the man in this fight. Like, he's not the main offensive unit but he he's the hardest individual hitter right now okay get yourself a full ether Like, I'll, I'll give Robo MVP status right now. Oh, yeah. See this shit? Is the crystal going to reform?
So she's being possessed by Lavos at the moment. That's a cliche for the queen to turn crazy out of the blue and not because of a period, but rather because of possession. I saw that cliche in Final Fantasy IX as well, which was released five years after this game. Okay, Shala is in the cut. <laughs> yeah, she can't stand that unnecessary self deprecation. Yeah, whenever she shows up, they always play the best theme. In fact, she might just be my favorite character just because of her theme. <laughs> he just darted across. I don't know if he's an asshole or if he's a badass. That line seems kind of vague to me. That pause just let us know that Chrono was about to play the brave role. See what the hell is the ruby thing for? The ruby knife thing. For all that being said, I think that I really don't know where we're supposed to go now. Okay, let's see. Zeal Palace. Yeah, it sounds like a great place to visit. We'll do that just now. Anyway, this is Mr. Wonka 7. Hope you enjoyed that badass boss fight. I think that's my favorite boss fight of this game. Easily. Without a doubt. A shadow of a doubt. And suck my dick. <laughs>